In this video, I'm going to show you how to use the filters in PubMed, or what are also sometimes called limits. You're able to use these only once you have done your search and you're on the results page. In PubMed, your filters or your limits show up on the left hand side of the results page. Now you'll notice there's only a few that are displayed. If there is a limit or filter that you would like to see that is not uh, appearing on the left hand side, all you have to do is come here to show additional filters and click. You'll notice that there are there are several others that are not used or do not appear that you can choose from such as languages. If you would like it to appear you can hit languages and then hit show and you'll notice that languages shows up. Now if you would like to apply some of these to your search in order to further focus it all you have to do is click on them like say I would like only articles in the last 10 years. It'll spin and you'll notice it's checked and it's it's applied and I may all only want any article that's written in English because PubMed is international in nature there are articles in here that are not in English but may have an English abstract and so if for some reason um, you don't want to run into those articles either because you don't speak the language or don't have an uh, opportunity to have them translated you may want to pick the English language limit. You'll notice they're not only uh, checked here but across the top here it'll also tell you that they that these filters have been activated. Once you've activated filters the only way to get them uh, deactivated is to either hit clear all or to go back and re-click on the particular filter you would like to take off. Like say if I want to take off 10 years, what you'll notice is I clicked on it, it's no longer checked, and it's no longer in my filters activated. Now filters are very effective when it comes to, to helping you to further focus your search. But keep in mind when you apply filters, they'll stay activated until you turn them off, and you can only see the filters or limits on the results page after you have done a search. And that is how you use the limits or filters in PubMed.